Alright guys, so I wanted to do this video and it may seem weird, but you want to know something? A lot of people struggle with this and y'all know your girl likes to make things easy for y'all. And I'm just going to make a short, make a quick short. You know what? I'm going to need the thread. I don't want to waste it. So I'm going to get how much I need. Now this is threading for doing the sewing, but the same thing applies if you struggle with threading a needle your girl's going to show you how to not struggle anymore. So with a needle, the needle has its, you know, spine or whatever you want to call it. You want to take your thread and you want to pull it across the thickness of that. And you want to pull it over the head of it. So see, these heads are to the side, which is really weird. All my other needles are not like that. And I have created a little mini loop. Could y'all see that little mini loop? Now what you're going to do is take this little loop and you're going to insert it inside this head. Do you see that? Do y'all see that? So I insert it inside the head. That is a quicker way to thread a needle instead of trying to get that one part in the needle and struggle and the one part just not act right for you, okay? So let's talk about the knot. Now, I have had so many clients, I was doing their hair right and I ran out of thread and my needles are empty which I'm so glad that my sister from South Carolina sent me an abundance of sewing needles look y'all I am not running out no more I will have enough to do a complete head and not have to stop that is my goal I don't know what happened to my needles since I've been here but they have disappeared which is really weird so since I'm gonna be threading these I said why not do this video so you take the two bottom tabs and uh, you want to kind of make sure your hand is a little moist or so dip it in water, lick it, whatever. Don't judge me and my ashy hands. So, yeah. So, you're going to take the bottom half and you're going to hold it in your hand. Wrap it around once. Now, see where the two pieces meet? You're going to roll the back piece over the front piece. Grab them and pull them. And you have now created a nice knot for sewing. Do y'all see that knot? It is in there okay it is in there and you could tug it tighter if you need to but you have created a nice knot do y'all see that you don't have to be trying to get the two and wrap them around and hold them you don't have to do all that you have created a sewn a needle that is threaded and knotted in less than basically this can be done in less than like five six seconds okay so let's do it one more time we're gonna grab one more and as you see, like I said, these are sideways. Well, this one is actually flush to the other side. Some of them are sideways, but we're going to use this one. So I'm going to cut some thread. Again, cut enough because I got to thread these anyway. So for video purposes, but let's not, why not do what I need to do anyways, right? Okay. So once again, you're going to grab your thread, put it into your needle like such and then you are going to flip the part over where you can see the little hole see how you can see the little hole and you're going to insert it insert it just simple like that into the needle pull the needle you see and we're going to pull it all the way this is the longest part is pulling it because i got the, these are really long pieces when i'm sewing i don't like to have to stop i want it all the way done so we're going to grab it the two ends once again wrap it around our hand till it meets grab roll you're going to roll the back thread over the right thread pull it and then create your knot so now you have a nice knot this can be done in uh, many things that you do around the house and you have little threads that you won't, don't want to come apart do the same thing grab it roll um, roll forward pull back and tuck and you have a knot this is a knot. This one of knots you can't get out. This is, you don't know how it started, where it began or anything. So I hope you guys enjoyed this brief how to and how to DIY your own needle. Thread your own needle really quick in less than like six seconds. Now, like I said, the longest part is pulling the thread through and getting it even. But other than that, the actual knotting is like a second and the actual threading is like literally two seconds. So yeah. Alright guys, love you. I hope you guys enjoyed that how-to and make sure you share this video with someone who struggles with threading. I know once your eyes get a little weaker and you get a little bit older, 
you have a struggle but that knot is easy for you and this should be easy as well even if you have your magnifying glass it makes everything so much more easier for you so later gators and remember stick to your script because you are the best at it talk to you guys in the next video make sure you look below because i have a list of playlists a long list of playlists with different videos that you may not have seen that you can share and that can make your life simple and save you some coins later